That's a big mother funk. What the fuck? You wanna start the car, huh? Yo, the rest of the on. Now, welcome to They Are Here. Okay, little birthday horror game here. Okay, I'm a big fan. I'm not gonna lie. I be I believe in aliens. Believe in all a lot of that stuff. I'm not not gonna lie. I, I sincerely do not believe we're the only peeps on this godforsaken planet. Okay, so freaking um well not in, in the universe obviously we're probably the only ones here but on this planet you know what i mean but anyway um yeah so like i said i promised a horror game on my birthday random horror game right here i just i just typed up i was like you know what because i was watching signs you know the movie with mel gibson probably one of my one of my maybe top three favorite movies right i was watching that i was like let me see if there's like an alien game and i actually looked this up and then i actually also found out that some youtubers actually have played this before so people have seen this so or let's say it's been played so I don't know if you guys are ready or not. Let's kick it. Okay. Unexplained phenomena occurred at Grayswood Farm on the night of August 7th. The Sherman family witnessed bright lights in the sky that moved at breakneck speed over the cornfield. The lights moved in a random direction and at different speeds. After a while, they vanished, just like the Avatar. This strange behavior in the skies was observed at the, t at the same time each night, five nights. According to the owner of the farm, all the animals went crazy. The dog became aggressive, tried to attack him, and bit him. The children complained that someone was walking under their windows. Farmer Peter Sherman, P. Sherman 42 Wallaby Way, Sydney, himself in the field, saw a strange figure that did not look like a man. But what was it? Deliberate deception, drawing attention to oneself, or a sensation about an alien invasion? Journalist Taylor Fox travels to Grayswood Farm to take a photo and make report. For the local newspaper i was reading that for so long that the music in the game restarted itself okay <laughs> all right let's go oh man guys i've been waiting to do another horror game for like a hot little second all right uh, let's do this all right i ain't gonna that little writing ish sound like someone was breathing like <gasps> all right let's go let's go all right Ooh, the graphics are clean, let me just say. On the top left, you guys can see I'm running on 60 frames per second. I want to see... Ooh! Take a picture of that. Okay, so Ish is really going down. I like that. I like that a lot. Nice. Okay. Yo, these graphics are, are sick. I'm going to leave a link down in the description also where you can download this as well. I got this from Steam, but you can also get it on uh, itch.io. You know, like I said, I was watching that movie Signs, and look, there's cornfield. The fuck? You know what? It's okay. Let's keep moving. Let's keep moving. Let's keep moving. The cornfields aren't as dramatic as they were in Signs, though, but still. Guys, I swear, that's such a great movie. All right. Very well directed, everything. Got amazing actors, all that. Farmers know. Mr. Fox, we made an appointment, but something bad happened. Our daughter went missing. My wife went to town for help. My son and I went back to check the farm. We'll leave notes for you in the police in case we pass each other. Be careful. Peter Sherman. All right. I'm going to do a little country accent for the farm because I don't, I don't know any. Well, there's plenty of brothers who own a farm, but still. Okay, okay. Not working. Well, that isn't. Well, it looks, sounds like it's working. It sounds like it's pick, picking up some reception. Hmm. All right. Got any food in here? No. Photo. In the photo, members of the Sherman family. Okay. So do we see their face? Okay, we do see their faces. In the photo. Okay, got it. All right. So it's the same thing. All right. So we can't run. I'm figuring that out. We can't crouch. Oh no, we can. We can. It's control. Okay. We can't run though. That sound effect of the door lock was the same locking sound effect that I, I heard in Locked Up. In the in the horror game that I uh, played recently. Okay, so you got some of the same sound effects. It's little things like that that you can tell in a, in, a, in a video game if you play them long enough or or hear a lot of stuff. You you you'll start to hear a lot of that stuff. Same thing with music too. I'm not gonna lie, you know, this seems like a like a subtle little spot, you know, clean little spot. Oh, look at a dog. Hey, I like how I said family because dogs are always part of your family. I don't care what you say. Okay. 
Ooh. Okay, so something must have happened to this dude because this man is ob is obviously a huge believer. Farmers learn. I've learned about these things. They're called the Greys. They're not little green men, but big, creepy, and dangerous motherfuckers. Basically, they can be described in the following way. A large head, disproportionate to the body, no hair, bottomless black eyes, gray skin, long, thin limbs. You know, it almost sounded like they were describing me until they went to the disproportionate to the body and then bottomless black eyes. When it comes to the gray skin, I mean, if I'm, if, I mean, I mean, there's some days when, like, the lotion ain't working too well <laughs> or it's not applied. These aliens are very aggressive towards people. It all starts with bright lights in the sky near home, which move along a certain way. Then people start to have a nosebleed, severe headaches, and a buzz in their ears, and animals start raging. Next, people start to have memory lapses. When they come back to normal, they find themselves in unexpected places. For example, in the middle of the field, on a road, on Griffin's bed, a few kilometers away from home. Some of them have flashbacks of terrible memories. People remember terrifying experiences. The aliens established control over their minds and this affected their psyche. Also, they found marks all over the body, incisions to be exact. During palpation, I have to look that up, it felt like something thick, like a foreign object moving under the skin. Oh, it ain't foreign, I'll tell you that. <laughs> all right. So, oh yeah. Oh yeah, photos from the internet. Perhaps Peter Sherman saw something familiar. It looks creepy. Okay. All right, so this basically aliens, okay. I'm pretty sure you can actually go on Google and like look these pictures up. Homie either looks high or he's staring at the sun a little too hard. Farmer's ch children diary sticker. Found my old diary when I was 15 years old. How could I forget this? Diary text. Today was the most exciting and scourge day of my life. I saw the aliens. My parents think I'm lying, but it's true, I tell you. I was fishing from an abandoned pier on the river. Suddenly, I was deafened by a roar coming from behind. I turned around, very low above the ground. A huge disc with four flashing lights or windows was hovering. I felt a punch that seemed to throw me into the earth. I froze there as if I was in zero gravity. Everything around me became blindingly bright and I seemed to lose consciousness. I remember seeing three aliens with gray skin and big eyes. I was placed on the table as if I was welded to it. They were standing over me. It seemed to me they were communicated with each other telepathically. Then one of them came over and did something to my head. I don't even remember anything else. I woke up on the pier later in the evening, I w and I, I, I skipped a whole line, and I barely made it home. My head was buzzing, and I walked home as if I was in a delirium. When I got there, I found several cuts on my body, and two small, but very smooth holes behind my ears. What was that? I'm scared to sleep. I'm gonna take a picture of the diary? Oh, take a photo of the diary. Okay, so that was the objective. I did! With, oh, okay, okay, I, I did do that. Okay, that, all right, but I say I did. Okay, all right. So homie's watching some type of stuff on there. I don't know what he's watching. As long as he, as long as he ain't watch. Well, I mean, hey, you do your do, man. At the same time, I don't watch that on my computer no more. <laughs> I watch that ish on my phone. If you, if you know, you know. What's in this room here? Okay. It's kind of it's kind of odd for a bedroom the door moving the door pulling outside into the hallway that's kind of odd I want I would want to pull the door inside all right so this must be Megan the daughter's room that's taken I say Megan because I'm seeing the name right there I'm gonna assume that it's this child's drawing it looks like this drawing was made by the missing daughter of the farmer the paper is printed on both sides Oh, okay, so here the dog is alive, warning the girl, barking, 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 and splat! Alright, gotcha. So basically, basically what happened in signs when the alien visited their house. That was such a sad part. Rest in peace, Isabel. This is my daughter's room. During the night, I heard a strange noise. When I came in, she wasn't in her bed, and the windows was wide open. I'm sure she was abducted by those things. And I'm assuming this is her? What the fuck? Oh! Is that the ship? Can I open this door? No, I cannot. Whoa. Oh! <laughs> Shit. Honestly, I decided to push left because it... Push left. Push F because it was dark. I, that, this whole time I didn't think I had... I didn't have a flashlight. 
Oh, man. What is that? That doesn't sound like the alien from Signs. They, the, the, the aliens from Signs sound like... Something like that. That's what they sound like. I don't know how to make that sound. It's a, it's a weird, deceiving sound. Why am I looking at the picture of the dog? Yo, aliens, what's up, fam? Hey, I'm a big, I'm a big fan. Was that chair knocked down last time? Oh, this door. Okay, that door is open now. I ain't going outside. You got a brother funked up. Yeah. Oh, that fucker's here, bruh. Can I open this? Yes. I ain't going to that TV. I've seen the ring. Okay, farmers know. Okay, some more. As a child, headaches began to bother me. They tortured me to this day. I went to the doctor dozens of times, but no one could explain the reasons for their occurrences. Now I understand why the doctors could not determine the cause of the migraines. The answer is simple. Abduction. I only remember the alien abduction when I found my old diary. It was then the migraines began. The cuts that I noticed then behind the earth were a trace of them. I'm, tr I'm sure they've implanted something in me. Some kind of transmitter or implant. Because of this, I forgot everything. I definitely decided that I would get it. I'm not crazy. Oh, he went, oh, the one you see this? What's this? A little jar with a strange device. Oh, so this must, oh, so he must have cut this out of his, so this must be the, uh, the thing. Yeah, let's take that. Anything else to look at? More photos? Photos of dead animals. Okay, I know there was something about, like, uh, like aliens, like, doing, doing these types of things. Nice. So the people that made this game be, did their research. I tell you right now, I'd be looking all over this like paranormal alien type stuff, y'all. I, I like no ish, bro. All right, what's this? Turn the flashlight back on. What are you doing? Okay, want to make sure. You remember them little old alien type movies that look like this? I swear, man. Nowadays. <laughs> Why does the image look like that? Well, come on, v put some respect on put some respect on VHS's names. They, they some of them are a lot clearer than that. I still got some VHS's not here, but in storage. <laughs> There's no way that's the TV. Oh, shit! Dude, you you have a knack of just turning your flashlight off, just w just willy nilly, don't you? All right, get the funk out this room. Can we go outside yet? Oh, that's a big mother funk. <sighs> okay, come on, let's go. I gotta hype. You gotta hype. I gotta hype myself up. Check your corners. Oh, he went this way. Oh, ooh, 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 who? I'm not a crow, but goodness gracious, that got me. What are the lights doing? Hold it, okay. Look like a flying kite in the sky. Oh, shit! That's my car. Is that my car alarm or something? Okay, my, my headlights are flashing. Oh shit! Go, 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 go! Nope, nope, fuck that. I don't, I can't run. Fuck this. I, yeah, I, I've been, I've been pushing shift this entire freaking gameplay, bruh. Come on! Oh my god, I hear him! C turn the freaking. Oh no, I remember UFOs can disable cars too. We fucked up. Is that, is that the UFO? Whoa, I ain't gonna lie, that looks pretty cool. I ain't, I ain't gonna front. Ooh. That's clean. And that issue's huge. What, you gonna abduct me now? I was just trying to investigate some. Ow! What the fuck? You wanna start the car? Huh? <laughs> In the 
full story, you will find the large territory of Grayson Farm and a full story of an alien abduction. Add the game to your wish list so you don't miss a discounted release. Well, I know it's planned for early 2022. Guys, this may be a game I'm gonna play. I love this alien stuff, but God, that scared me. That scared me. You know, I'm gonna go ahead and do that right in front of y'all. Yep, add to wish list. There we go. All right, I added it to my wish list. That's what I'm talking about. All right. <laughs> Goodness gracious, guys. Oh, that was a good one, though. All right, everybody, I'm gonna cut it right here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Great freaking game. Good little startle scare. Bruh, I can't, I can't wait. Developers of this game, I know you guys aren't gonna see this, but still, gotta give you guys props for everything you guys did, just for a demo, like, for a demo that was clean, like, the graphics were so smooth. It just looked clean and everything was smooth, so, blah, blah, so smooth, so I can only wait what a full game release is gonna be like. But anyway, guys, thank you guys uh, for celebrating this on my birthday. Um, Man, it was su su such a good game, such a good game, such a good time. We got that Mario Kart, and then we got some, and we got a good horror. Next game, okay, yeah, next game is gonna be actually a decent game. I actually haven't, I actually haven't played that game in about five months, so that'll be the next game. I have a calendar right there, as you guys can see, of uh, videos planned. So, anyway, I love you guys. I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you guys very much for celebrating this on my birthday. I'll see you guys in my next video. Once again, I just said that's why I said that. Take care. <laughs>